Welcome back to SourceFed Fan Week. Hi there, Twitter user at N7Ian Doherty. How are you? I see you at six foot ginger. Look at me, I'm a 5'8 brown guy. Hey Joe, remember in Harry Potter when Harry Potter had to take the Skelligrow potion in order to make his bones grow back? <laughs> no, dork. No, you're right. That's a horrible, horrible example. I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. I should have known that you would know nothing about how Harry Potter lost his bones in a hippogriff fight. Oh wait, wasn't that Gilderoy Lockhart? Nerd! Oh! <laughs> oh! You dork! I knew it! Oh, you got oh, me! I caught you! you. bait and switch! Oh, oh you, you evil b well, Joe, it turns out that in the real world right now, we don't even need magic or skeletal groves. Apparently, we're already growing appendages from our own bodies. We covered a story a while back about a woman who grew an ear in her arm with the help of stem cells and science. But now, there's a case of a 56-year-old British man who lost his nose to cancer. But no fear, because he's now growing two noses on his arm. Two noses? Two noses! <laughs> Whoa! The new nose began as a glass mold based on the original, and then it was sprayed with a honeycomb-like film for stem cells to attach to. Then the biological nose frame of stem cells gets coaxed into forming cartilage. At the same time, researchers insert a small balloon into the man's arm and stretch the skin, making it loose and a perfect place for the new nose to grow. Now, the new nose will be ready in about three months, and then it can be attached to his face again. They even model it after the original, a little bit crooked, and that's the way he wants it. So boom, pow, new nose! And why two? Well, just in case one goes horribly wrong. Like a drop it on the floor. Or something. Yeah. You don't pick it up in the five second rule. It's gonna suck if he loses that arm. What a waste. <laughs> Three months growing a nose in your arm. Like, oh, start over. Why not more than two? Just no, an arm of noses? Just a back of noses. noses. <laughs> the fact is, it's insane that this kind of thing is even happening nowadays. We have the ability to grow new body parts. Now you can cut off your nose to spite your face and not worry. Ha! Screw you, face. Funk. Three months, new nose. In fact, the head professor leading the procedure, Alex Cephalian, says he hopes to eventually grow a whole new face in the lab. That's amazing! A whole new face! That is weird and cool! Although I don't think it could help him if they lost a body part to, like, dark magic. I mean, look at George Weasley. Ah, oh, you nerd! You nerd! You're a nerd! You're, you're a nerd! You're a giant nerd! You dirk, dirk oh, nerd! Oh, dork nerd! Oh, uh, you... Oh! So guys, what would you grow extra of if you could? And I'm challenging you to not put a dick joke down there. Let us know in the comment section down below! Like, subscribe, annotation, sourcebed.com. I'm Joe Beretta. I'm Lee Newton. We love the fans. We love the fans! Oh man, so many. I'd grow so many dicks. Oh. Damn it, Beretta. <laughs>